Lady Luck and Melvin just weren't on speaking terms. I went around and I applied for a job at uh, places like uh, McDonnell Douglas, Northrop, Hughes. Well, what happened there? They didn't want me. Well, I might have done something. Like what? I'm Howard Hughes. Well, you know, listen, I believe anybody can call themselves whatever they want. Things weren't going too good for Melvin. He just lost his job. Listen, that wasn't even my fault. Melvin, what can I tell you? You don't come back here tomorrow. His pickup truck was repossessed. Hey! And his wife walked out on him. Oh, my God. Oh, hey, Melvin! Come on down out of there. Come home with me. Come on. Oh, oh, you're you're right. Right. No one much cared about Melvin. Then Howard Hughes left him $156 million. Oh, my God. Melvin, I want you to move that down. Howard Hughes Company, the Sumo Corporation, claims that this will is a fortune. Melvin, I'm going to have you thrown out of here, sir. That's it. Send him on a good Coast Guard, EDX 325. You remember me, don't you, Melvin? We were all together. You, me, and Hall. You're lying, Dumour! You never saw him! You never met him in his life! Do you swear in the name of God that this story about how you received this will is true? Melvin, if it meant eternal damnation in hell, would you still say it just happened that way? I want the truth. <laughs> Howard Hughes sang Melvin Dumar's song. That's what happened. He sang it. Pack <laughs> up all my cares and more. Here I go, singing low. I'm a blackbird.